Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adama and this is another vlog, I guess. It's been a minute and I haven't like recorded anything, I think since like my birthday vlog. So I guess I'm doing this. I guess I'm doing a vlog. So I have something good for you guys. I am installing a, I don't know if y'all have seen like the book case to target bookshelf like hack or whatever to do like a closet install and so i purchased these from target i am currently doing like a beauty room makeover so i'm gonna take you guys on this journey with me as i do this um do this makeover so let's get into it i have four um target book case shelves right here that um i've done over the course of a few days every day i kind of just like did one or two um and so i don't know yet how i want to set up the bottom i'm just not sure yet like i don't want the whole i don't want all of the top to be like clothes so i don't know like i purchased these these are the um oh, oh god these are the rods it is the adjustable closet rod by Everbill, and I got these from Home Depot. They're the 1830. So these are supposed to go like this to hang clothes, but I can't figure out how I want to map out the closet. I don't know. Like I try to get some inspiration on on not on Target on Pinterest, but I'm not sure. Like I know I want to hang like some type, like blouses here or blazers or something here so a hanging rack there a hanging rack here and then all shoes here i oh, don't know i gotta figure it out y'all <laughs> clip I think I was showing you guys my bedroom that I am turning into like a multifunctional space so like my bedroom my beauty room my closet you know all of the things so I'm gonna show you guys um what the room looks like so far um I have finished I didn't record putting um like my shoes up in my clothes so I'm gonna show you guys where I left off and we're going to get into like this is not a tour this is just you know the process of me putting this room together the room is empty right now um so we're going to get into all of the deets like the inspiration for the room um i'll probably put up on the screen um as i go along in this vlog just um like the items that i purchased what we're waiting on um to arrive so i'm going to show you guys what we have so far all right guys so this is my um bedroom slash closet space closet space please ignore this vitamin water um i'm just showing you guys the real so this is what it is um so these are four bookshelves from target they're about i don't know maybe 35 36 bucks and so we have four total um i got this amazon um like rack uh or wall i don't know what you would call this like wall mounted rack i got that from amazon and i just i wanted to hang all of my dresses here well not all of them but um my like most worn dresses or maybe dresses that i want to wear that you know kind of get lost in the sauce but so the way i did it i just kind of hung up my i have a lot of button-ups recently I've been like loving button ups. It's just easy to kind of throw on and it like still looks put together, but still casual. So I have my button ups. I have like tops here. I have all of my like midi skirts that I wear often and I have denim skirts there um, that I wear often. 
And so that's the like clothes portion there. I have my perfume. Um, I still have things coming up. Don't mind this stuff. This is just things that like I had on the floor and I kind of just took it up and put it there. But um, so I left these two bottom shelves empty because I want to put like, these are like a lot of my sunglasses. These are like a lot of my sunglasses and I wanted to get some type of organizer for my sunglasses. So I'll show you, I'll put up on the screen what I ordered and purchased from Amazon. I also link those in my Amazon um, storefront as well. Um, they By the time this video goes up, everything will be linked in the Amazon storefront. So that is that. I don't know what I'm gonna put in this shelf. I know I wanna do my sunglasses here, but I don't know what I'm gonna put there. Um, I kind of just try to leave room open. So I have a lot of my mules there, sneakers, and like my heels, and sandals. And I'm still, this is just for now. Like this is just the way I set it up for now, but I probably will rearrange it differently. I just wanted to get an idea of what everything was going to look like and how I wanted to place it. Um, I'm probably going to get, those are just up there for now, but I'm probably going to get like some purse, um, like these purse racks or hangers that they that you can hang like your purses on so i'll probably put those up there or something like that i ordered a few things on amazon so they will be arriving tomorrow and um the day after that so these are all of my dresses and i'm just so happy that i have somewhere to place my dresses because in my closet in my main closet they usually are like on the bottom row and they get all bunched up at the bottom. So this is the space. It's a pretty big room. Um, I just ordered a vacuum because our vacuum broke. So I just ordered that off of Amazon. I also ordered my bed, which is gonna go here. It's a day bed from World Market. I already have that. I'm waiting on the mattress to come. I did purchase that from Amazon. So I'm going to link all that stuff below. This is my mirror. And I'm just so glad that I purchased this from Sam's. Um, and I really wanted it to be here because when I do like shoot video content, like I can just easily like shoot it here. And I have like my closet in the background. So I just thought it would look really nice. So like this is the vibe right because you can see the clothes in the back so some things that I want to incorporate in this room I definitely want to have um like an office space something small or maybe like a like a vanity that can function as an office space and a vanity um like a desk and a vanity and maybe something that moves right so if i need to shoot any video content i can place the vanity here and this will be the background i'm just trying to think of some things that will be functional for this space so yeah so i'm just trying to think of some things that will be functional for my new space so far so good i'm really loving it i'm so proud of myself my dad helped me put you know up the rack and did some minor things but y'all I built these shelves all by myself I did so good I'm so proud of myself um I also wanted to show you guys because I feel like you guys are going to ask me about this so I did want to show you guys these um poles because I know you guys are probably will ask me where I got these from I got these from Home Depot no yeah Home Depot and they are the like 18 to 30 inch um poles or rods and you can get those from Home Depot I'll link it down in the description box and I'll try to put it up on the screen to show you what it looks like but yeah they were about less than ten dollars or like nine something and yeah like this was really easy like for anybody that wants to do the Ikea pack system this is a hack for sure I mean, it's not going to be like, you know, you don't get all the flexibility of like drawers and all that stuff. But honestly, I feel like this for the price, I mean, I'll get you guys an exact price of like what all this cost me, but it wasn't the cost of an Ikea pack system. That's for sure. Like one of these bookcases from Target costs about 35, 36 bucks. So yeah. All right, so some things that I have to do today, I need to sort, I have some, a bag of belts 
and I have some purses that I need to kind of go through, um, see what I have that I want to either display or um, like I need storage, right? So I need to kind of figure out what are some of the things that I feel like my closet space needs and see how I can incorporate it in this space to work for me. Um, I also have a lot of things that was in this room. I had to take it out and I actually need to like sort out my closet. I'll show you guys the closet right now. It's crazy, but this is what it looks like. This is literally everything that I took out of this closet. Like that's the closet that we have to organize. So yeah, I have my work cut out for me, but first I need to like get rid of things. So every like product that I do not use, I'm gonna use these black bins from, that I got from Ikea. I'm gonna continue using those, I like those, but we gotta get rid of some stuff. Like it's just too much. <laughs> closet that was a lot like that was so much I'm exhausted um I do want to go through my sunglasses right now it's kind of dark in here y'all um I want to go through my sunglasses oh, I guess I should open up the okay so I want to go through my sunglasses my belts and my handbags and kind of just sort them out and see what I need to give away and see what I want to keep and what I want to display. So let's get into that. I'm going to go through my belts. And I need to get rid of a lot of belts like this. This is like two, an old dress that I don't even have anymore. I still have this dress, this trash belt this do I have this still I don't think so trash don't keep this keep don't want to keep maybe this is worn out so well actually is it we can keep that this y'all this belt is older than me this is my mother's belt and it's just so retro so cute so I'm gonna keep this keeping this belt I got this from Shein keeping this belt so cute from Target Keeping this, that's she in as well. Well, I think I got from the thrift. Really good belt, I'm gonna keep. I saw this belt organizer. They're like these round magnetic um, cases and you like wrap the belt 
and you sit them in and they stack. So I think I'm gonna order that off Amazon. And um, let me pick out the ones that I wanna display. All three of the belts that I think I'm going to display, they all have like, you know, decent buckles, pretty buckles. So I have three brown and three black because I think it comes in a pack of six. So if y'all have any like suggestions on how to store your belt without it looking like just a mess or unorganized, drop it down in the comment section. Okay, so that's the belt. Handbags. I don't know how I'm storing them yet. Or maybe like some dividers. Okay, so I just sorted my bags and sorted my belts. And now I'm gonna um, go through my sunglasses. I have sunglasses in the car too, but I'm gonna go through the ones that's up here because I have a lot of sunglasses and sometimes I don't even know which ones I have. <laughs> and I need to know like how many I have total because organizer I bought I think so I bought two different kinds I bought a two pack that I think holds six in a case so that's 12 slots and then I also bought like a spinning one that you can like hang the glasses on and you can like turn it it's like on a little thing what they call it I forgot what they call it but y'all know what I mean so got these glasses a lot by Zilu. If you haven't checked out my um, review on Zilu um, sunglasses and like little personality glasses, check out my review. These are so cute. I haven't worn these in a while. These are the Luebe dupes. I got these from Amazon. Um, I forgot the name of it, but the name of the brand, but they're linked in my Amazon storefront. So I got a notification that the vacuum cleaner that I ordered from Amazon, that it was delivered today. So that means that we can begin to clean the carpet. So I'm hoping and praying that my dad cleaned the carpet for me. Like that's what I hope happened. <laughs> um, I hope he cleaned the carpet already. So that way it'll be dry by tomorrow and I can like lay my carpet down, my rug down. That's supposed to be delivered today as well. And what else is supposed to be delivered tomorrow? The bed is supposed to be delivered tomorrow. So I don't have any um, bed sheets for the bed. It's a day bed, so it's a twin size bed. So I think I'm gonna stop by Target on my way home and see if I can find some twin size bed sheets um it may be some pillows or something like that oh no i'm not gonna get pillows i'm not gonna get pillows because i always do this i have several pillows and i don't need to buy pillows i can just buy a pillow cover and put it on the pillows that i already have so we're not buying pillows pillow covers i can get from amazon i don't know the vibe yet that i'm going for i know that i definitely want to keep things neutral my um rug is like a cream and pink the majority of it is pink and it has like cream in it so i'm excited to see that when it comes i'll show you guys that today but yeah so we're gonna head to target and i'll take you guys along with me see you in a little bit
why there is all this noise going on when I decide to shoot a video. Like, are you serious? Okay, guys, so hopefully you guys can hear me, but this is the room so far. The closet install is pretty much done. I have some, like, minor, like, aesthetic things that I want to do there. Um, and I have things that I'm purchasing from Amazon to kind of organize that part of the room. But I did order a rug, and that just got delivered by Amazon. So I'm going to, we're going to roll that out. And, um... We just cleaned the carpet, and so it's pretty much dry now. So we're going to go ahead and lay the rug out. My mattress is supposed to be arriving today. We'll be able to put the bed up today. Like, So we, we got some good things going on today. We're going to put the rug down, and we're going to put the bed up today. I'm so excited. Let's go. Okay, so this is the rug, y'all. And I think I got an 8 by 10 rug. Is this 8 by 10? I think so. Uh, it doesn't say, but I will link it down below. I think it's 8 by 10. So let's unroll this. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so what do y'all think? Like, look. I love it, y'all. It's the perfect size. I love it. So, see y'all, it's coming together. It's coming together waiting on the bed oh no not the bed we're waiting on the mattress but we can put the bed up i need to get my dad my dad to help me put this bed up okay let's take this up So I wasn't sure, y'all. So I wasn't sure if I wanted to place the wall, um, the bed on this side of the room or here. This was always my first choice, but I was just like kind of concerned because when I film content, um, I wasn't going to be able to film content from this side because the bed would be blocking 
um it would be blocking like over there like where my shirts are but it's fine i mean when i film i can just probably film you know like straight ahead so i think i'm gonna leave it like this for now they really like the mirror in the center please excuse the walls i still um <laughs> i need to paint and i know y'all probably like well why didn't you paint first but it's fine i'm just gonna like touch up the wall so i do over here let me zoom out what do you guys think comment down below on what you think i should do with this with this wall I love the the mirror being the focal point, so I don't know. And then I really want to place the vanity over there, but the bed is blocking. So if I'm filming content, you're gonna like see the bed in the background. So I'm only kind of left with this space. Let me know what you guys think. I could also move the mirror over here in the corner and kind of like tilt it, like right here, but then the bed will be blocking. So that's why that's the only reason why I was considering moving the bed over here and then moving the mirror here and maybe doing a vanity here. I don't know, but I like this being the focal point, right? Let me know what you guys think. So the only thing that we're waiting on right now is just the mattress um, from Amazon and what else? The mattress. And that's kind of it right now. I haven't ordered anything else, but I'll do like a big like room tour like once I'm like done done. Um, but for now, this is what it is for now. So it's coming along and I'm so excited. But I'm going to end off this vlog here. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.